This summer I had the privilege of joining Dr. Dean Lomax for a spot of fossil hunting on the Jurassic Coast. Dean's a renowned paleontologist and specialises in ichthyosaurs and was now visiting the Jurassic Coast on a small trip away. So join Dean and I in this video as we mosey along Charm of Beach fossil hunting. For you then, Kevin, because obviously I know you work for the Jurassic Trust uh, and volunteer as well. Yeah. What's your, you, you, you don't live locally, like, so what was your draw down here? Was it, was it the fact of, because obviously I said for me, it's research mm. it's for walking the footsteps of Mary Anning and there's a, the entire history of Lyme Regis, the, the town here, and, and also, I should say, of course, meeting many of the, the locals down here and the other paleontologists and stuff. That yeah. I always find is really fascinating. It's always good fun. Yeah, yeah. You too. So what, what's your kind of key draw down here? What's Well, I mean, Again, it's, it's like with most people here, it's, it's the fossils. It is the fossils. I mean, I'd be lying if I said it wasn't. You know, I, I love fossils. Um, it's always fascinated me. And my first trip here, I, I believe the earliest memory I've got of fossil hunting was when I came down here on a school trip. Yeah. And um, I, I found like a tiny little piece of ichthyosaurus rib. And I was like, what, six or seven? And it's just stuck with me ever since. And I really do think that is what drove me to this but whenever I come to the beach wearing my my blue shirt my Jurassic Coast Trust shirt because I like being able to help other people have a good time and enjoy it because for me part of my enjoyment of the Jurassic Coast Trust is being able to help other people enjoy it and get the best out of it as well because yeah. nothing makes me happier to see people actually finding fossils and really because you can come here with your family on holiday and you go oh that was a load of rubbish we didn't find anything and then I, they'll never come again yeah definitely. you know right yeah we'll just take a little Sit, uh, sit down here um, and have a little look through some of the stuff that we found in the past and yeah, whatever not, we managed not to... Much today. Oh, not much today. What? Oh. Just a small piece of ammonite here that we've got, mm. in, got in there. Yeah, that should fit out quite well. It's like a I need some, little or something. Yeah, I need some preparation. Yeah, a little pressure on the back as well. Yeah. Oh, so nice. Nice, nice little bits out to have. Of course, I got stuff like that, obviously, just a bit of a oh, beautiful. bit of a ammonite that's just eroded away, obviously, just a fragment, the impression, and then you've got yeah. some of the calcite, calcite. there on, on top, which would have filled some of the chambers. Presumably, that's what's happened there within the chambers of that ammonite, but again, only part of it. I found um, put that in the water there. Yeah, because you've got oh, there calcite you go. crystals yeah. there as well. Yeah, yeah. Quite nice. Yeah, that's so lovely. <laughs> yeah, very nice. What else? You got anything else from today? Or? That's it. I've yeah. got like little a bunch of bellum nights and bellum nights bits and yeah, bits. Oh, oh well, it's not a fossil, but it's not a little yeah. shell. They are one of the most misidentified types of fossils because you pass us one here. Okay. Oh, yeah. So yeah. these are some of the most misidentified fossils. Can you imagine? First thought for that is, oh, it's a dinosaur, dinosaur tooth. tooth. Yeah, sweet. Yeah, yeah. sort of yeah. or whatever. But yeah, these are squid-like animals. And this is just the, the thing called the rostrum or guard, which is mm. inside the inside the squid-like animal, and it has a little body chamber here, and it's arms. I actually brought along some pieces that I actually promised you that I would just oh, to yeah, kind of yeah, show yeah. you. I'm to these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah they yeah, were literally yeah. about a meter apart from each other. Check them out. Yeah, they're all right. You've got jumbled pieces of yeah. um, skull bone, I reckon, in there. Bone, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm well chuffed with them. I said I picked up one. I was like, oh look at that, and then meter apart. Oh, another. Yeah. Yeah, it was wicked. Not quite. I mean, because you can see they're all going in different sort yeah, of angles yeah. and all. But that's, that's a neat little jumble of bones. It's and cool, isn't it? It is an ichthyosaur piece, right? Yeah, so, yeah. yeah, yeah. Nice. It's just satisfying to have. Yeah, it is, yeah. Uh, these are great, but obviously the uh, the gem of uh, the gem of my finds. That oh, one there. Yeah, look at that. It's all right, that, isn't it? Yeah, I found that one down. God, it would have been about two years ago when I went fossil hunting with Mike, Mike Harrison. All right, yeah, uh, yeah. I asked Mike if he'd uh, take me down here to show show me where it's uh, how it's done. Lovely like that, look at that. Beautiful teeth. And it just goes to show that you've just got to be in the right place at the right time. A anybody, yeah. you, you don't have to be an expert. No. You don't even necessarily have to know what you're doing. You just need mm. to know what you're looking for. Yeah. And it's right there waiting to be found. Oh, exactly. It's look, but it is. Yeah. yeah, very nice piece of it. Yeah, we chuffed with that. Yeah. Yeah, well, I had a feeling that you'd be quite interested in seeing that one. Yeah, yeah, a really lovely piece. It's good. Yeah, Thanks, keep yeah. hold on. <laughs> keep that one safe. That's yeah, at the forefront of my cabinet at home. Yeah. Um, but really, it's been fantastic being able to mm. finally go fossil hunting with you along uh, my part, my neck of the woods, so to speak. Yeah, yeah. You'll yeah, have to it's... invite me up to... Uh, to Yorkshire, yeah. To Yorkshire. Show you some of the, the fossil hunting hotspots around there. But no, yeah. it's been a pleasure. Yeah, really, really good. 
really enjoyed it. We've had a lovely, lovely, lovely day as well. We've been very fortunate Not with the weather. Not found too much, but you yeah. know, it's never all about the fossils. It's just nice to be outside, good company, and, and you know, chatting. Yeah, fossils. likewise. It's all about our interest and passion in paleontology. It's always Absolutely. Nice. Yeah. Well, until next time. Yep. Alrighty. Yeah.